Hi. Let me tell you about another great Manning book. ASP.NET Core in Action, 3rd Edition, by Andrew Locke. ASP.NET Core is an open-source framework for building dynamic web applications. It's versatile, allowing for the creation of server-rendered web apps, back-end server apps, and APIs for mobile apps. It uses the latest version of .NET, a high-performance cross-platform runtime. The framework provides structure and helper functions, reducing the need for excessive coding. ASP.NET Core supports various paradigms including minimal APIs for mobile and browser-based apps, web APIs with more structure and features, gRPC APIs for efficient server-to-server -server communication, Razor pages for server-rendered apps, MVC controllers for server-based apps without page-based paradigm, Blazor WebAssembly for browser-based single-page apps, and Blazor Server for stateful apps rendered on the server. The choice of paradigm depends on factors like API requirements, existing app integration, browser and operating environment, and scalability needs. Microsoft recommends ASP.NET Core for new .NET web development. It's a modern, high-performance, open-source web framework that uses familiar design patterns and paradigms. It can be run on any platform, including Mac, Windows, and Linux. It offers cross-platform development and deployment, focuses on performance, has a simplified hosting model, and provides regular releases with shorter release cycles. When a user navigates to a website or types a URL, their browser sends an HTTP request to the server hosting the web app. The server processes the request and generates an HTTP response, which can be a web page, image, or other file. The response is sent back to the browser, which displays the content. ASP.NET Core handles the request on the server side, including validation, login, and generating HTML. The process starts when the browser sends an HTTP request to the server. The request is received by the ASP.NET Core application, which uses an internal representation called HTTP Context. The application uses the information in HTTP Context to generate a response, such as HTML or an error message. This book provides an in-depth tour of the ASP.NET Core framework. It is recommended that you have familiarity with c -sharp or a similar object-oriented language, as well as basic knowledge of web concepts like HTML and JavaScript. Throughout the book, you will learn how to create page-based applications, understand key ASP.NET Core concepts, use minimal APIs or web APIs to build RESTful or HTTP APIs, generate HTML using Razor syntax and tag helpers, Utilize features like dependency injection and configuration. Implement security best practices and more. The examples in the book are small and self-contained, allowing for focused learning. While Visual Studio is used for most examples, you can use your preferred editor or IDE. The book also includes instructions for setting up your development environment on Windows, Linux, or Mac platforms. Get this book at manning.com.